So if you, as you can read the description today, we're going to be trying to finish the barn. Um, I'm hoping to get it all done today. So it wasn't my testing world. I'm going to go back in my normal world. Um, my dog. I don't know why it's barking. Gotta love it. They hear any little noise and little dogs bark at everything. Kind of annoying. But, uh, yeah. Doing that, that's kind of weird. No idea. Just trying to look up. Audio's gone. Wait. Okay, make sure I tweet, tweet it out. <laughs> All right. All right. So, in my bed here. Okay. Uh, let's see. There we go. Let's see. Need this here, this here, this here. I can say. Cut that off. That. Me too. Me too. Shouldn't need any shovels, but I'm gonna keep one. Sure need stone slab. Wait, I am gonna need the cobble, so we need the scaffold and I'm gonna get a couple more. And actually, first thing we're gonna have to do guys is gonna have to go out and go do some I think a stack and a half could be enough scaffolding. I'm actually gonna have to go out and get some wood. Go mine go and go to the auto tree farm and get down some trees. I need to make a better way to get over here from outside. I think this thing's all the way at the other this is the this end of the base. The thing is all the way at that end of the base. I need to come up with a better exit strategy. <laughs> As I said, one of the one of the plans is just to start making another hub and all that. And I think I mentioned this in the other video about the and I don't know if I showed you guys this. I had to change I think I showed you this. I changed my villager thing. I put glass around it with a a door now. Now I can get in there. And no zombies can get in here. They can come look, but they can't touch. I think that's what happened. I think the last time, I think somehow a zombie made it over the lava. I don't know how. But yeah, all my villagers, all these ones down here were gone. They just disappeared. And I don't think, I know they couldn't have climbed out and jumped out. But somehow, they all died. They were all gone. Only one that was left was him up there. So, yeah, I have no idea what happened. Yeah, I probably should break out from that. The auto tree farm. Let me stack saplings. Plant the tree. Let me just stand out here. Put another one. Unfortunately, this this tree system only works with oak, which I am um, gonna make a bigger one. This works with oak. I mean, oak is pretty good. I like the way it uh, but I do want to make a, a I'm gonna make a new one over there. I'm gonna tear this one out and put a new one over there, which will when they extend out this way, that basically it's gonna push them this way, so I get a huge block of wood instead of just a line of twelve. I really need to fill that hole in. Ugh. Beard is itchy today. Shave. Let me just let this go until it gets to the end. Then we'll chop it all down, do it a couple more times. I 
need I need a lot of these logs. This is what I need. I need just the logs to make the um the framework inside the barn. Cause I actually want to make it look real. Like there's actually something holding up the roof, not just a big open space. And I gotta remember to on the way back grab some torches, more torches out of the thing. So I light up the inside. If I light the inside, the sandstone, the the light actually will glow, so the whole group of the thing at night would be glowing. Alright, that's it. Can't go any farther. And actually, I think I just goofed, because, I mean, when that happens, guys, it usually breaks the system. So more than likely, I just broke a piece of redstone from that. And get rid of that tree, and then I can put another one down here. And I'll shut it off. Yeah, last time that happened, I actually, like, popped two pieces of redstone off. I don't know how. They just, like, they shorted out and popped off of the block. That's how I do it, guys. I just go down this line. Drop all these ones out. And then, all I gotta do is just look straight up. Good. And with the new system, it will have, like, I, it'll pick up the saplings automatically for me. I won't have to go running around trying to find them. There are saplings everywhere up here. There's another one up here. I can't get it. Oh, well. But you see, like, just using that. You see, it's not at this. You know, I had six. I had one stack, sixty-four. So, so see, I've already got a lot of my trees back, sixty. There's more up there. You know, you, you don't really run out of trees. That's that much to use. So, you know, just in that one job, I, mean, I did get a full stack. I mean, if I get if I can get three stacks of wood, it should be more than it should be enough to go and do. A lot of the barn. And I know I have enough bone meal in this thing. I'm not worried about that. Part. Keep an eye out again, and there it is. It's one thing you have to do is when you break this this log, it updates that. I'll put you down real quick. That's it. And I actually need to get, um, everything, that's on there. Uh, 
I need to get fortune on an axe. Then it then it gives you more wood. I think I might actually go in there and go do that enchant. Or go to the anvil and put fortune on this. This pick at or this axe. Or maybe grab a new one. See if I have a new one. I'm gonna go try that guys. I'm gonna go see what happens. Get dark anyway, so I'm gonna run inside. And unless I can figure out a way, something to do with that thing, which it may just be a mass storage, I may just make two items that go into it, and I think it might make it melons and what and um, pumpkin. I can make a pumpkin farm or something that way, because then we can not only buy pumpkins from him, but then you know. Um, I think one of the farmers, you could trade him melons and he give you emeralds. And I mean, if I get a bunch of water melons, make a watermelon farm and have basically a silo full, uh, yeah, I'd be like buying diamonds all the time if I can do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, lay down. We're gonna go see if we have a, a new axe or if we don't, we'll make a new one. And go put check out what books we have. Let's see. Let's make any books in here. I know I have a bunch of books. I have a bunch of scanning books around here somewhere. A whole bunch of books. Just gotta find them again. I don't remember where. I think they're in here. There we go. Thorn, 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 six, six, thorn, 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 thorn. I need fortune. That's what I need. I need a fortune book. Uh, let me see. I know I got some a couple more somewhere. Ah, I'm stuck in the door. Fortune three. There we go. That's what I need. And I think we have a new pickaxe, a new axe somewhere. Yeah, I feel like this one's so tight. I've been enchanting a couple of things. So touch on that to get just the grassy dirt. Looking for an axe. I don't want that one. I want to broke it. I want to mend one. I'm planning on just like pushing this one. Oh, maybe in here. Yep, there we go. I'll just take that one. That's for everybody to use, so hey. Alright, let's see if we can do this. Uh, I didn't. Okay, Fortune 3 X. Coming right up. Now, let's go chop down some trees. I'm trying to think of a faster way to get the hell out of here, guys. <laughs> uh, I think just going up to the to the thing, and maybe I can jump off and land on it. I don't know. This ought to be interesting. Stay tuned. Will Grey Wolf die from his stupid idea, or will he make it? Ooh, buddy. You think I can jump down to that? You think I can make it without dying? Yeah. That's good. Some parkour. <laughs> parkour. Get the get the saplings. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh. Alright, let's do some more trees. I wish there was like a set number that it took 10 pieces of bone meal or something to do a tree. But it's just, they're never consistent. Like, look at that. That one almost was instant. This one's probably going to take forever. 
It was on like, that was like a couple clicks and done. Gotta watch how far it is. Okay, one or two more. So. One more. Right there. The end. We're going to use our new pickaxe, our fortune pickaxe. I don't think it actually works on wood though, so I'm not sure. So then look and see how much we had. If I can get three stacks of wood, I'll be happy. I know that I go work on the barn. Ooh, those are fast. I want to make sure I don't miss any saplings anywhere. That should be good for now. Almost three stacks. Of a pig on a cliff. Oh, oh pig in a hole on a cliff. <laughs> he ain't going nowhere unless he decides to jump. Right, let's go inside and see how all our stuff is doing. Let's get our forward out here. Still got the sheep inside the freaking pig. I don't know why he's in there. Well, at least I don't have like any any mob spawning inside the in here. Let's see how our seventeen. 26, uh, 16, and some zombie flesh. So obviously a zombie fell into this, and he got cooked. <laughs> nice. Okay, I just don't want him falling in this, so what I'm going to do, guys, I'm actually going to cover, put like a block of glass, like right here. I might put like a couple more pieces of this stone, and then put a block of glass on top or something. Just to get them. Mm -hmm. TK, stay out. Now. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. Of course that's going to do that to me, right?
This ought to be interesting. I want it to look like the rest of it, so that's why I'm doing that guy. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. I think it'd be okay. I think this would be the biggest section in the barn, you know, it's gonna be... You know, I mean, how big are the other ones? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It is a little shorter because I went off of this when I made it, laid it out instead of where these were going to go. But it's a good thing I did that way because then this would have been the f I couldn't put the stair over it there. You know, I'm thinking instead of the, be the beam coming up out of the ground, you know, I'm thinking I'm thinking the beam would be on top of this. So maybe take out one of the see where it's gonna end up. Put it in the middle. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. End up right here. You no, know, the beam would end up right there, that's, that's not bad. It's a, it's a big section and everything, and there's nothing underneath it, so you know, I think that works. That works, which means there'd be another beam right there. Don't want to fall on that one, that's for sure. I don't want to fall on any of these, that's why I want to cover them up so that way I don't have to worry about them. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put trap doors in the wood part so that way I can access this one. Say there's something, I don't know, anything wood spawn in there, but you know, a baby zombie. I don't think a baby zombie, I don't think anything can spawn on slab. At least not this way where I have it, where it's going to be one half lower. But like, I am still going to put, like, the oak plank. It's not going to look like this one. These are, these ones right here, upside down stairs, and then I still have the planks. But this all will look the same. It'll all be this, this same stuff. and do that side now. But I do need to find out how big I am planning on putting two more cooking two more cookers in here guys. I'm gonna put a I think in a pig and a cow. Uh, maybe not. I don't know. Maybe I just add three more chicken cookers over here because chicken seems to be the the hard one. They're always you can always breed all the rest of them really easy. But the chickens, you know, you hit the breed limit really really quickly. I have at least, I mean, I breed on maybe, maybe I, if I bred these two together and then bred their baby together and then I bred them, I'd probably hit the limit right then. Because I was breeding, the, I only had four, four chickens in the thing and I was hitting the breed limit every time I bred those four. So I was like, okay. Right, jump down here. Find out what this one, that one right there, yep. There. I think maybe I'll just make this into like a storage area or something, or maybe maybe I will put the more more cookers in. You know, cause I can always put those in after I build this part. At least after I build the the framework, I don't have to put it in now.
I mean, I'll put it in this part. I won't put it in the ceiling over on this side. Style kind of barn. Okay. We're eating the hay and the grass grows back because I put the water in there. So, yep, I have happy, happy sheep. And I do need to go grab the stuff and make the door. That'd probably be a good idea. That's a star guy. I'm gonna go upstairs. Go like that. That's the other thing in here, guys. You can't run really because you'll have to pick the ceiling all the time. The way I'm gonna have to finish the walls, guys, I'm gonna have to build the floors, floor by floor. So that too, I gotta figure out where the ladder is going. Where the, or where the, I gotta plan out the stairs, because I want the stairs to come up. I pretty much want them to come up the center one. So, you know, you come up, you know, you come up some stairs that go up here, onto a little bit of a platform. A little platform and then you need to go left or right. So, yeah. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna plan this out real quick. Sake of argument, you know, we have two stairs there. So like that. Two. Let's see where these guys end. I'm gonna go on this side, do the same thing. Let's see where they end, so that way I know. That look like it's gonna be too hmm, kind of debating now. Is that gonna be too small of a stairway, or I may need to take out that beam. Yeah. This. There we go. Perfect, perfect. Nothing when you're trying to move over and you got a light next to you. can't actually make it up because this beam's in the way, so that beam may actually have to go with these two supports and everything. Oh no, the supports would stay. Just the beam has to disappear. I think that's okay.
know, neat little trick, guys, that I learned putting up the other stuff. Hey, Black Up. How you doing? Driving me nuts. Okay. I'm gonna do that. And I mean, like, the, the, these blocks aren't gonna stay here. They will be going. That gets like like too too weird. But I don't want to get rid of the beam. That's the problem. I don't want to get rid of the beam. Because guys, my original plan was is that I was gonna take. But I think you know what? It looks pretty cool with the light coming from the floor. Plus there'll be lights in the in the ceiling at the same spots. You know, so this place is gonna be lit. This place is gonna be lit up big time. He says that. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm gonna send a message to the other guy too, real quick, guys. Sorry about sorry about the blue screen. Eh, you know what? I'll check his out. I'll check his name out after the stream. I'll find out if he wants, and maybe we can show it tomorrow. That's why you don't lend your friends your stuff. Because they're not going to take care of it like you would. Well, now, now you know what? Now your friend has to go buy you a new copy of it. Or his parents have to go buy you a new copy of it. Tell them to take their butts to Walmart.
I'm so glad that this is, I'm making these out of wood because if they were stone, I probably would have chopped right through them by now. Mm -hmm. Get all these side ones done so that I can just go along and get, get the rest of them put in. I won't have to drop back down, build the pillars, and then go build them up so high, and then just go through and put them all in. Which now I'm thinking, guys, I don't think I have enough wood actually. Mm -hmm. Change the texture pack. Mm. I like the city texture pack. Just me guys, does that look kind of weird that I have like a log going into a log? I think maybe it should be a beam. It went through the system. Sandstone. See why I want to get this covered up, guys. I I hate falling down on this thing. Can you imagine if I fell on that one? <laughs> Cook gray wolf. the scaffolding I'd be able to get to the sea to the roof. Seeing as how I'm not gonna make it like, well, wait, a minute. am I gonna make it like that? Yeah, I think I am. Okay, then I don't need these. Cause the chicken, I am, I'm, go I'm gonna put three more chicken cookers in here, guys. Uh, at some point, I don't know when. But yeah, I think that would look really cool if I had three more chicken cookers right here. I think the stairs work out really well. I think we go up and we get this. So I need to get the door to keep the dogs from spawning. I need to go out here and make a door. Uh, check and see what I got. That's 
the stairs. Got some stairs. Cobbles. Dirt. Mr. Enderman. <laughs> See, I hate when I have an odd number of in the back of my head. Okay. Come on, sorry, let's go put this stuff in. The fun part is going to be trying to put the upside down stairs over top of inside this part. Nice floor. Um, all I have to do now is like look for where these are, and then just come up here and just punch holes in it to put in where the trap door is going. Well, that's where have to go. Because it's every two blocks. Grab, I grab that one. Okay, now this one should be down here in the chest. There we go. I'm gonna go meet the trapdoors now before I forget. I'm gonna do this now before I die. I know, I know, I know. In this texture pack, they don't look like Yeah, really, I 
like, like this thing has a big enough overhang where it, yeah, it casts a big shadow right here. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to put as much detail into this, but I'm like, this is like a super build. It's just like the courtyard. I want to put as much detail into it as I can. I want them all to go the same way, so I'm like lining them up. Okay. Drop down here, start putting in the... That's another thing, I gotta tear this out, because... Oh, I gotta tear that one out. I gotta put in... I gotta put in more stairs. I'm actually gonna move the stairs down to here. Oh, you just had a fried chicken! A stair. I think we'll have a stair there. That mm. there. Yeah, I guess actually, I'm actually gonna make them out of wood, so I'm just putting these for. I wish I could just put them for placeholders and break them out, but I don't think I can hit them from inside the thing without breaking this out. Yeah, I'd have to break this one, a couple of these out. Tear it down, but that's good. That, that would work. Then I can always put like some of these fence posts in the back and you know, like, strut supports. Maybe so it's gonna be placeholders. Okay. Stay there. That in. Step. Last step. There's that. Break that. Break that. Get out. Yeah, there notice that when you open a gate, if you open it from that side, it'll it turn. It goes this way, you open it this side, it goes inward. It always goes in away from you. Hi, sexy Mike. Is that supposed to be sexy Mike? So you guys are wondering, if you're wondering where I got the the idea to build the chicken coop, the chicken um cookers at. It's actually a uh, uh, mumbo jumbo and uh, Skippy Six Gaming. All those guys, they all do pretty much the same kind of thing. They're all pretty much the same. So I just picked the one I like the best and built it. I do need to access the chickens, put more eggs and make more chickens or whatever. I now have access. And I have a nice little ladder that leads me. I, I guess I don't, if I have that one, guys, I don't need that one, do I? You know, because you just come right up here, get them up. 
You're upstairs. What do you guys think? Should I get rid? Should I get rid of these stairs? I mean, they weren't gonna stay sandstone, but they're gonna be wood. But you know, I guess, I just think it's too big for a barn. I think it's just too big and grand for a barn. This is something that a barn would have. There's a little staircase that's like kind of hidden, just so you don't know how to get really get upstairs. And if you guys can tell me why, like my shirt like does this, I have no idea. I'm wearing a black shirt. It's gonna be a nice crisp line. It's like it's like static all around me. That's the funniest thing. I do know my camera is kind of moved wrong. Yeah, guys, I'm, pl I'm planning on moving all this stuff around. What do you say? What do you guys say? You say you get rid of these stairs, right? These stairs, they don't fit. They, they're just, it's too big. It's just too big, and then I should put the beam back across and just build the floor right across the top. That's what I should do. I, com I completely forgot about the, the little stair that I had next to the chicken coop and everything, and I like. See, I like making stuff in the wood with the wood and everything, guys, because it's a little. If you go to start chopping it with a pickaxe, it takes a lot longer to chop through it with the pickaxe than it does normal. So I mean, if, if, you, if I'm breaking something that's brick around here, I can go up to this wall, hit that freaking that wall, and it'll break in like one hit. If I have any logs left, so I can make the beam. <laughs> that's what I do. This guy. That way they all look, they all look the same. That one I'll do after I put in the two the other hoops things. But then I gotta make some more levers for the beam supports that are gonna go all look that go here, here. No, those ones. Then maybe on this back wall I can just put like some chests going up. You know, put like four chests. Put two there and two there. This is five wide. But like Regular chest, regular chest, trap, trap, regular, regular. Just put like four dump large chests and then two itty bitty chests right there. And then just put like a. Uh, that way the braces can go in and everything, and everything you still see, and it'll be storage for all the animals. That way, you know, if somebody comes in here where they want to shear the sheep, well, there's, there'll be a sign back here, I'm probably on this post, it'd be like shears in this chest. Go get the shears, you put it in there, you put Come over here, shear all the sheep, all the wool you want. Have to breed some more sheep so we can do that. There you go, this is what happens, guys. See, the babies can't burn. The babies can't burn. But as soon as he grows up into a big chicken, he gonna be barbecue. And, guys, this thing, this thing works. It goes. Like, I've got 18 in here, I've got 27 in this one. 17 chickens in there. Alright. Why aren't... Oh no, next time an egg comes through there, guys. Next time an egg lays, that chicken is gone. That one right there. There's always one that's been... That messes up. See, like, I don't know why that's still out. It shouldn't be out. There it goes. Cooked chicken. Chicken just sucked in. There's 17. Now there's 18. Yum, yum, yum. Yep, I like this. I like this. I like this. Okay, yeah. 
start building these up now. One, two, three, four. Right down. Yeah, a lot more wood, ain't it? <laughs> yeah, it's gonna take a lot to get this barn done. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna build scaffolding across so I can finish this part. Stone here. Uh, crouch. Face. 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 Cut one off it. Sand stairs. I'm just gonna crouch the place all over. This is planning construction work at its finest. There. Oh, that one went in backwards, didn't it? So did that one. don't need one here because he brick is going to come up so everywhere where the brick is going to go guys there isn't going to be like a like a thing so there's that floor A tip whenever you're working with wood in Minecraft, make sure you have an axe with you. Makes your life a lot easier. When you go and try to chop it apart with a pickaxe, it takes freaking forever. Exit down, double them up, and it's gonna. It treats it like it's a full block, which I hate that. Let's say like if I went up there and I put one on top of that one, now I could break off a single one. I think the barn looks really cool, guys. How about you guys? Hello. Just walk on in right on. You know what? No. You're not walking in. You're leaving. Permanently. That's just the longest ass thing to kill because the sound just like stays there for a while. That's annoying. Sound. Okay, I have to go get more. Yeah, 
if it can make it out the dang door first. Let me go see if I have the stuff I need to fix that door. Like I hear something. Eh, yep, I heard something. I heard him. I heard him. Heard those footsteps. Yeah, everybody, everybody says creepers don't make noise. Yeah, they do. You just have to really, really be listening for them to come up on you and really be paying attention. Because you can hear, they walk on grass, you can hear them real easily. But it's when they don't walk on grass and they walk on other stuff that, yeah, that's when you end up getting yourself killed. Yeah, I'm going to put all this stuff in here. I'm just going to go AFK for a little while on the, the wood farm. Get rid of all that stuff. But I am going to do some item droppage here. Mm. I do have some more. Huh. I need that. Uh, don't need that so. Okay, how about this chest? Mm. That, 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 that. That. I gotta check with this one. No, I'm looking. I'm looking for the brick. I had a piece of brick. Good deal. I was it brick out here. I had a. I had one brick. It came off of the wall. No, I think I died and it got destroyed. But yeah, there was a brick. Yeah, I can put the the broken cobblestone in there too. I found this stuff, this cracked cobblestone, and it's simple to make. All you do is you put cobblestone in the furnace. You make you make the regular cobblestone brick or stone brick, and then you just put it in the furnace, and it'll put it back out to you as being cracked, so it looks like this old aged brick. I just think it looks really cool. Okay, we're just gonna. This one here. This one here. What I'm actually gonna do, guys, is I have two doors. I'm gonna put one there. And put one there. That'll keep out anything from coming in. Plus, it gives so good luck a bit of light. But yeah, we're gonna go. Go lay down. Grab like. I'm gonna grab some torches because I wanna put. I just wanna use torches up on the walls. Couple torches. A few stack. That'll be enough. Over here. Anybody wants to join, right here is the community. Um, if you're looking to join, join up and play with me on PSN, on Minecraft. If you are, I'm, I'm gonna change it. The rule was, there was a community server that was just like pixel art or anything you guys wanted to build was in there. I'm gonna change that rule. If you guys want to come play Minecraft, join, join the community. Okay. And we will start playing. I'll start letting you guys come into this world as long as you do not do any griefing. Um, you guys don't know what griefing is. I mean, doing any damage, causing harm. You know, no coming in here and dropping a bucket of lava inside of where my villagers are. Or, any, or destroying anything, causing me, like, headaches. Any of that stuff. As long as you guys don't do that, you know, you're more than welcome to come in here and play. But, I will tell you this, if you do start griefing, you will be, 
Not only will you not be allowed to come back in here, but you will be kicked out of the um, community. I will kick you right then. I will stop, kick you from the server, and then kick you out of the community. Just so I remember your name and don't have to worry about figuring it out later. Yeah, guys, this is my sorter for the mob farm upstairs. I'll wait for one of those to go down. That in. And I got more bones. My bones, bones, bones. Oh, more, more gunpowder, dude. All that is sorting going into these. I think I actually changed this one to bone. Yes, I did. So, yeah, the string needs to come out. This one's air. Going to flesh. Yeah, I can see this is skeleton. Zombie. Uh, I think this one's not got anything coming out because they're not. Ooh, yeah, that's right. I don't have these ones set up yet. I gotta actually do that. <laughs> I gotta set up these hoppers. That could have been why I had hoppers in my inventory. Yeah, these ones aren't gonna sort anything. That's just like the gunpowder. The gunpowder is being backed up. And I mean, once they back up, they're gonna start just spitting their crap into this one. Yep. Alright, so yeah, I gotta finish doing the sorting system, guys, because it's just gonna drive me nuts. Okay, so right now we're gonna go we're gonna go get some more wood. We're gonna we're gonna try to finish the barn. At least finish that layer of the barn. And well, I gotta check on my brick. I may need to get make more. Ah, go in the door. Check on my brick supply. I need I need at least a stack. And I don't think I actually have any. Not enough that I can do it. Yeah, see guys, I I've been we have a spider spawner. And I actually went or a skeleton spawner. I actually went down there and stayed down there for like two hours killing killing. And I mean this thing is really really efficient. And you don't want to know how long it took me to transport all these from where it was to here. <laughs> it took a long, long time, a lot of running. I went through a lot of food to keep my health up to be able to run all of it. Because I decided I, decided I didn't want to. I, you know, these aren't hooked up to hoppers or anything. I just wanted a place to put it all. But pretty much I'd wait until I filled the chest up. I had my inventory empty except for a sword. And I'd fill my inventory up and then come back up here <laughs> with all the bone and I just I was just pitching out all the rest of the stuff. All the armor, arrows. Or actually I think I have a chest down there that's full of arrows because I wasn't getting a whole bunch, but I was getting a bone every single couple bones. A bone or bones every time. Uh, yeah, we're, no, we're looking for looking for brick. And I think I only got a couple in here, so I gotta make some more. I mean, they gotta go looking for clay later. Where's Clayface when you need him? Shove his butt in there. Ooh, Taz is doing GTA and he has actually sent me an invite. I may actually go do that after I get done doing this live stream, guys. Excuse me. I'm actually gonna have to stay over here for quite a while, guys. Get enough trees to go finish this. Eh, good thing is I do have a bed over here. So, you know, it's not like I, I gotta go back to the house or anything. I might as well do this. Okay. 
kept my bone meal supply here. Looking good. gonna go until we run out of bone meal. Just making trees. We run out of bone meal. And like I said, I have all that bone in there. I can turn in the bone. You get you get three things of bone meal for one bone. So I mean, you know, you look at that. Every I had what three chests. Nearly full. Oh. So I guess I got like a hang now that keeps on catching on my hand. Shit. This is a crappy one. Yeah. There we go. That was getting freaking annoying. See, and to you guys, next time I build this, I am actually going to build it down in the ground one. So that way, you know, then I can go and I can chop it upwards and everything. Oh, that dog's dead. Not really, they're just fighting. Like one of them, like one of them moves while they're both laying down, and the one doesn't like it. So she like goes after him by saying, "Quit moving." Saplings. Get the wood here. Can't get that one. I gotta worry about it. Ooh, an apple. Damn fly. Get out of here. Courage the cowardly dog. Dogs make me look bad. I don't know if anybody else has ever seen that, sh that show. That was funny. I used to love watching that cartoon show. Hey, midnight. How you doing, man?
See, I like when the trees do that, when they instantly, like, and they're fast and they go and do this. Fly. I just love when you have that one fly that will not leave you alone. It's like the buzz of your face every few minutes. Drop any over here. Really, really sorry. Got it. Freaking dog here. Weather, weather. Weather here, it's, it's nice. It's in the 70s. You know, it's right in the mid 70s, 76 right now. Outside, yeah. No. It's nice. See, like I've been, I've been out, I've been out that way a, a lot. I don't think I could ever live out there. It's just, it's too. I know it's a dry heat or and all that stuff, but yeah, no. Shoot, I bet when I went to Vegas, uh, two years ago for a, for a pool tournament and everything. There's some freaky ass weather there. Hey, Taz. Yeah, Taz, I'm gonna jump in. I'm gonna get on GTA here in a minute as soon as I end my stream. Um, 
So I'll, I will be coming to race with you guys. Get invite. Just trying to see like how long I got. Yeah, see, I I don't have long. I'm just trying to use up all this bone meal. I don't have that much more bone meal left in this thing to to go, and then that's when I'm gonna end my stream as soon as the bone meal ends. I didn't realize how much I still had to go on my barn to finish it. <laughs> I have to do some a lot of a lot of this. I'm gonna have to build my other my other thing. I'll probably just do a couple of videos first and then splice them together. And post it. It's gonna take a long time to build that. I think I put that chest a little too close to this. That was. Did you, you guys notice that? How everything just disappeared there? Yeah. You gotta love when those glitches happen. Ooh, I've got a log down there on top of the cobble. Not out yet, because it's still going green. Actually, you can check the hop over here. Yeah, look at thing is. Come on, tree. Sheesh. Yeah, that one take all the energy, but that one took about 30 Hopefully this time when I go racing with him, I, I don't get kicked or lag out. I, I it wasn't that I got kicked. Is that I think I think everybody else lagged out or something, and then you guys were all in a thing, and I was still stuck in the clouds. And <laughs> I think I was stuck in the clouds for two races, and I didn't even realize it. How oh, did you destroy? Uh, he didn't take out any of the. Hey, at least he didn't destroy any of the farm. That's fine by me. Let's do this real quick. Uh, the platform for the trees to fall on. I heard him and I knew that hole was there, so I was like, I'm jumping. Right, those guys are deadly. I don't know about you guys, but those guys are deadly. You know, and the funny fact is, I can't believe that the guy, like, was trying to make a pig and he goofed up the coding. And ended up with the creeper. <laughs> I'm like, I'm just like, huh? And I learned that fun fact about Minecraft. Yeah, the guy, the guy, uh, Jeb was making. He was or whoever it was. He was making a trying to code a pig. He's trying to put the code in for a pig. Oh, you. Uh, Now that would be when I really hate creepers, because there goes. Oh. Yeah, it's not going to push the logs out. It's going to leave this block here. 
Uh, I, nope, it even blew up half the chest. All of it. So, yep, it even took out, it didn't take out the redstone, but it took out the piston. Where the hell did he come from? Oh yeah, like I, when I next time I build this thing, I'm building a wall around it and lighting the inside of it up, guys. Um, how much? None in there. That's all I got left. We're just gonna see how this goes. It's not gonna push the bottom ones out. It's gonna put leave them there. I just gotta chop them out of the way every time. Yeah, we'll, we'll keep on going until we run out of bone meal. You already like emptied one slot. Like that one's not gonna stop. I don't know if it'll stop the twelve. I think I've told this as far as a piston can push. It'll only push out to the 12th. The 12th block here. If I mean, yeah. No, it's not that much. It's one more. Now we'll, now we'll find out. Can this push it farther than 12? Nope. All right, guys. So we've got let's see what four four full stacks and forty eight so far. Got that some apples. Some more. See, like the next one, I'm gonna put a whole ton of freaking hoppers around, and all the leaves are just gonna go into a freaking chest somewhere. Okay, let's go. Make two more trees. It'll give me a full. Okay. 
And that's it, guys. No more bone meal. No more bone meal for today. Um, like I said, we're going to end the live stream right here now. Uh, I'm going to go go racing with Taz Maniacs. Um, uh, I will be streaming with Taz here currently. So if you haven't come back 7 o'clock, probably about 25 minutes. You know, be back up with another live stream. Doing some race GTA racing. And all of Taz's crazy, crazy raging races. Uh, yeah. Yep. I hope to see everybody in about 25 minutes. Oh, well, 24 now. See you later.